Hi everyone, I hope you guys are very doing very good and I hope you guys are having fun in this summertime. So I hope even you are having a great Sunday and looking forward to tell you that God is blessing everyone in this summertime. Now today I was blessed to sit with an amazing girl, like you can see her, she's so beautiful and she's so talented. I think you saw a lot of videos that she's been doing with Caesar and she's been doing a very great work and I think that people sometimes we feel like we have a gift of talking we feel like we can do something we can translate but people don't believe that it's a work that someone can do but today she's an example well I used to be very sad that there's no one else that I can see a young woman who feels like I can be a translator but today I have someone here a special guest so I'm going to give her time so that she can tell us her name welcome what's your name my name is Kayla Kayla how are you I'm fine Kayla, how old are you? I'm 10 years old. Oh, she's 10. She's 10 years old. And Kayla, when did you felt like, I'm ready, I want to be a translator? When did it start? Did you see someone and feel like I want to be like her? I mean, tell us, give us a testimony of how you started with this amazing gift. Sometimes I saw videos, you and Cesar doing some videos and I liked it. Yeah. I translated for him and that's... Where it came from. Oh, okay. So was it your first time to translate? Yes, it was my first time. Okay, so when did you feel like, okay, today I feel like I, I, my English is good enough to be, you know, to translate. How did you feel the first time? Did you feel nervous? Did you feel, tell us, how does it feel? Uh, I felt happy and I was happy that I was going mm -hmm. to meet some and people would come and say, oh, Kayla, how are you? I am a big fan of you. Oh. And that's so okay you do you started to say that I know if one day I'm going to be a star so if I started by here but a star in God right yes oh wow that's really amazing so Kayla you know when we do such such a job I mean me and you we do the same job yes. so what what are the obstacles that you met for the first time when you started to do this kind of a job what is the obstacles that you met I mean, you are young, you are still 10 years old, you are not used, maybe you are still in Sunday school, there are some things that you don't know. So what was the obstacles that you met? Uh, sometimes uh, Caesar talked about words in Kinyaranda and they were hard for me to speak, but I tried some I know mm -hmm. and those are the obstacles I only met. Only those? Uh, sometimes I felt I feared the camera. Oh, okay. But I became so calm, so very, and I started thinking that I'm, I'm brave enough to do it. Mm -hmm. So I started doing wow. it. Wow. So, Kayla, in which class are you exactly? I'm in primary four. Oh, great. Okay. You are in P4. Yes. And uh, you. What, 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 what can you tell young girls? I mean, right now there's someone who's sitting right now and she's seeing an amazing young girl who is 10 years old, still in primary four, but she's doing this amazing work. So what can you tell to the parents who have people, I mean, children who stays at home doing nothing, yet they feel like they can not do something like this? What can you tell them? I can tell the parents to let them follow their dreams okay. and I can tell the parents to ask for the, the money for, to pay from, for the, their kids' school fees yeah. and to, because God can do everything. Amen. Yes, and I, I can tell those kids to continue be, be, being comfortable and not fearing the camera as I did mm -hmm. earlier, but they need to study hard and follow their dreams so they can be true mm -hmm. and continue praying and asking from God. So this is your dream? Um, my dream is to become a pilot. Okay. And I wanted to translate for Caesar mm -hmm. and so that I can continue following my dreams and people can know me and I can continue following my dreams of becoming a pilot. Okay, so here's the thing. There are two different things. So we have a dream and we have a career right yeah. so uh, your career the thing that you want to do for earning money it's being a, per a period right yes and do you want to be a translator for fun yes oh no so here's the thing so translating did you know that translating it's a real job 
uh, I don't know, but I thought that translating, mm-hmm. uh, I thought it's God, uh, it's serving God. Yeah, it is. Yes. And let me ask you something. When you are translating, you use effort, right? Yes. Did you know that everything that you use effort can make you earn money? Uh, I didn't care about money. Yeah, but I'm asking. Uh, yes. Okay. So here's the part. Now Kayla, she's young. She's ten years old, and she's still in P4. But today she's doing an amazing, gar- amazing work in God's house. She's helping out in translating and spreading the gospel of God all over the world. For people who understand Kenya Randa, who understand English, Kayla is here to help you guys understand what the word of God wants. Want, what God wants you to understand. Now, what I wanted to tell you is that if you have a kid. Or if you are a child, but you feel like I have a dream in me, I have strength, I want to talk to people, I want people to understand, to know that I have a gift of translating, this is the first step to make. The first step is to be brave as Kayla is right now and make a first step to sit down and then you talk. You be sure. Because I believe that soon you are going to be translating in your church, right? Yes. You're looking forward for that. Yes. I think you should talk to your pastor and next Sunday you should start because you are so amazing. I've been looking at your videos and you're really amazing. Thank you. Now, if you are someone and you're looking for someone to translate for you, he's Kayla. She's really good and she's, well, she's amazing. I guess you saw her video. And I'm looking forward to tell Palant and uh, to tell, you know, young children who looks at my videos, her videos, that we are here and we are looking forward for your help. So you call us on our call, our number which is on the screen, to tell us if you need any kind of help. We can help you to grow your talent, right Kayla? Yes. Don't you feel like you want to tell students or to tell young children, I mean your age mates, that they can do it? Yes, they can. Because in God there's there's nothing impossible. Yeah. And God can do anything for you. Amen. And tell me, what about someone who'd be like, Kayla, I don't know English, I don't know a language, so how am I going to be like you? What would you tell her? Uh studying hard is what I'm telling because if you pray and study very hard you can know English and nothing is impossible yeah it all starts by feeling like i want to know something and when you feel like you want to know it's that the first step after feeling like i want to know something then that's the first step then we can help you me and kayla and we are looking forward for you guys to contact us so that we can help you to reach where we are now right yes. don't you feel like you made a very good step yes um. i believe in it and and uh, I thank God for giving me this opportunity to... Wow. So thank you very much, guys, for following us. So we are looking forward. And if it's your first time to follow our channel, please do subscribe and even, you know, share our videos so that people would know the word of God. Remember, Trend Program is here to help you understand, to live in the word of God. We take the word of God and then we live in it. That's what we generally do. And moreover to that, we do believe that God gifted us with amazing gifts, such as hers and mine. And we are looking forward to even make people understand that those gifts can be used even to, be, to help you survive in this world. So contact us. We are looking forward. Ciao. Ciao. Ciao.